Trist, was it like exciting to have this character that that in this extraordinary circumstance kind of comes in and in a way takes charge of all this bullshit that's happening in this house? Yeah, it was. Yeah. And so unlike me, like I would never walk into a house like that and stay there alone. Like that's how scared I am as a yeah. person. I just, I'm like, I, that house is just creepy. It was creepy. So yeah, I was kind of impressed by her. Um, but it was fun. It was just like, it was more physical than I thought it would be. Yeah. Like, yeah, because you're running around, you're like, screaming your head off. You can't practice stuff like that. You can't be like, oh, I'm gonna rehearse this at home. You can't rehearse screaming. And then we had to do more screaming in ADR. Cause yeah, because you can't just keep screaming and then your voice, we had to do more screaming in ADR. And I remember just, the guy was like, just, just scream and we're just gonna go and then I'll tell you when to stop. And I had to like squat down <laughs> and just oh, like scream so loud that I started sweating. <laughs> <laughs> like, I was screaming so much and breathing, and it was just, it's messy. It's very messy. Is there a, a, a trick or a technique to that so you don't blow out your voice, or is it just lay it all on the floor? And yeah, like, I it? went to acting school. We have vocal technique, but I think horror movie screaming, I mean, maybe it's something that if I did it again, like, I would maybe be better at it. I don't know, but I don't, I don't know how you practice it. Like, I don't know where you go in the world to scream and practice a horror movie scream, because people will just lock you up I, or something. I think a lot of people are born with that. Yeah, absolutely. Born with that, like yeah. born with the scream. Yeah. <laughs>